Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be making granola because I really love to have that for breakfast. So for this recipe you will need oil, coconut oil, cinnamon, you need honey, raw if possible. Um, you need oats. Do not get the instant oats. You need these ones because they need to cook together with all the other ingredients. You need cranberries or sultanas if you like that better. You need sunflower seeds and you will also need sesame seeds. So now we have we have the honey, the oil and the coconut oil boiling here. So you just keep stirring just to make sure the coconut oil um, doesn't stay solid. And then here we have the sesame seeds. They're already heating up. As soon as they start to pop, I'll cover it so they can start uh, popping but not falling out of the pan. And just when they start to turn golden brown, turn the heat off and take them off the pan because as long as they stay on the pan, they'll keep cooking. Okay, see you in a bit. Okay, we have the one kg of oats, two tablespoons of cinnamon, uh, one teaspoon of nutmeg, we put a cup of sunflower seeds and one and a half cups of cranberries. We're going to mix this up and then we'll put the liquids in here and mix it all up. Then it will be ready for the oven. Okay, now everything is ready. It's all mixed up. Um, now that everything is mixed up, you're going to put it on a cookie sheet. But you're going to put it as a very thin layer so that everything can cook evenly. If it's too thick of a layer, it's not going to cook well you can see it made two separate cookie sheets and remember do not um, put a thick layer of this it needs to be thin enough so that they all cook together and they cook well so now we put them in the oven yay they're finally ready it's time to take them out they've browned nicely now let's see how they look once they're out okay as you can see this is a nice golden brown we're going to wait for it to cool and then now we'll put it in the other container for storage. Look at that. Isn't the color so beautiful? Okay, it's finally ready. Now, as you can see, it came out as big chunks. And so, I mean, you can either leave it like this and then cut them up into smaller pieces like uh, a granola bar. Or you can crush it. You can even do this by hand. Just crushing it into smaller pieces so that it's easier to have uh, in your cup with some milk or with some yogurt. So you can just break it up into smaller pieces. But like I said, if you also want a granola bar, you can just cut them and then go home and, I mean, go to work and eat them. So, yeah, they came out as very nice big chunks. It's pretty good. Yay, time for breakfast. I've already broken up the cereal into smaller pieces. Now, I like mine with yogurt, so... Yeah. Ready to eat.